Okay, so yeah, we went a little over, but we're good. Anyway, so yeah, this is the next part. So yeah, this is the next part. Welcome. I'm still dodging enemies, because I can. Oh, okay. We're gonna use... So you're gonna need to use Park Harry to get over here. Man, I was keeping an eye on that, too. How bad is that? Okay. Oh, oh no. Run. And if you go behind that rock, there's a surface. I know, Ryan. I know things about this game. I, I know, but I would just say, say it in case you forgot. <laughs> just, what happened to you? Just... Okay, anyway. So yeah, there's a star piece, and we're about to get owned. What? <laughs> Why did he see us? Wow, he's stupid. Okay. Fail. Luckily, that rock is insanely stupid. Okay, we get a coin. I don't think that's anything. I have to do it anyway. Oh, coins! Yay! Get to, get the coins. Okay, go back to Lady Bow. One of my this is definitely one of my favorite party members. All right, now we are at Tumble Blubba's mansion. This mansion is not that hard. Uh. It can be pretty freaking annoying, though. So, let's go ahead and enter it. Alright, so we see those little flying helicopter guys. Uh, so don't be seen by them. If you get seen by them, go ahead and go out of, uh, go out of sight there. Because they won't hurt you, but they will throw you out of the mansion. And then you have to, so you'd have to go back to the beginning. So be careful. We will see them later in this level as well. Alright, so those are the enemy for this... And, uh, they're the little... They're those things. They got spiked clubs, and they're pretty annoying. I forget if you can jump on them or not. You can, right? I don't know. If, if they're asleep, if they're and asleep, you just walk, yeah. you won't wake them up. And you walk, you can walk by, uh, just not. This is one of the few situations where sl the slow go badge we got a while back is actually pretty useful. Yeah, it can be useful. When there's a lot of sleeping enemies, you can just put, put on that slow go badge, and they won't hurt you. Actually, because it's a new enemy, I'm gonna go ahead and go into battle with these guys. Oh! He did that fast. Alright, so yeah. So they have two different attacks. Uh, they'll either do three hits that all do one damage, three consecutive hits, or one damage, or one hit that does three damage. And yeah, it just depends on what they feel like doing, I guess. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use Hammer on this guy. They got eight health. And, but they have no defense, so you can use smack on them. And bam, bam. Boom, four, four damage. Lady Bow is very useful. Ouch. That was a little early. Okay. Go ahead and do this again on this guy. I'm actually not using much F here yet. And he's down. One more. Yeah, and none of your attacks will do eight damage, even if you use no. FP, so there's not really any point. There's no point using FP unless you can kill him in one shot. Boom. And they're down. Awesome. So yeah, not too tough, but pretty annoying. When there's four of them, it's like, really? Nice amount of coins there. Alright, so first we'll go in this door. I don't think we can do anything here yet. Oh, right, we can. Yeah, just go in these blocks here. And grab this star piece. Sweet. There's actually nothing else in this room. Except for him. And we do not have to fight. And you break open those boxes and it doesn't even face him. But if you walk too fast... Oh, he will notice yet. We can get that star piece later. It's kind of hard to get, though. Not really. Kind of, not really. It's not. <laughs> so. Boom. Ah, uh, you didn't see me. I, for I really do forget whether if you can jump on these guys or not. I don't really want to risk it. Oh, you can. You can? Yeah. You can jump on them. Okay, you can jump on them. You can use it. Oh, never mind. Okay, I was just making sure. Okay, you can jump on them. Yay. Good to know. So yeah, you don't have to use your hammer. Nice. I just didn't remember, I guess. Okay. Mm, power jump won't kill him, so I'm not going to use power jump. Just a waste of that tape. Boom. 
But because it does the same as your hammer, it really doesn't matter what you do. And later we will get a power smash, which is the same thing as power jump except with your hammer. Yeah. Go in this door. Alright, we'll go down here. Usually a sleeping guy, but if we just walk, he won't notice us. And you can go around him. Except when you touch him like me and be an idiot. Dang it, ugh. Curses. Uh, that is so fail. Wait, no, that'll only do two damage. Alright. Let's get these guys dead. Dang it. Ah, I'm sorry. That is so fail. Oh, rage face. Their lips are so huge. Jeez. Weird. I was just sitting here watching like whatever. Like her for dirt. <laughs> there are like no panels in this mansion. I don't I don't know why. They never There, are, there aren't a lot in here now. I don't think there is one. Um I no, really actually I don't think there no, are there any aren't any panels. panels here. There aren't any of the panels that Oh dang it. We're good. We didn't see us. We go down the hole. And yay, we get to this treasure chest, and we get Castle Key! Yay. Awesome. Now we can continue on. Oh, we get a health box. Sweet. Boom. We love those shaka, things. Shaka. We love those things. We're already halfway to a new level already. Sweetness. Oh, yes! Boom. Oh. Now, Another you super can make Bao do five damage. And I definitely would go with Bao. So now, she does an extra slap. So now it's five damage. General rule of thumb is whatever party member you are using for that chapter is the one you upgrade. Yeah, I don't upload. I don't upgrade Goombario yet, for sure. So yeah, now she can uh, do five damage instead of just the the, uh, the, the four. So now she's really useful. Haha, <laughs> didn't notice me. Line of sight. Owned. All right. Go ahead and go up, buddy up, buddy up. We're here. And we're back to this. So now we can go back completely and go through the other way. Did I go through that door? No. I didn't. Okay. I'll show you what's in here. That <laughs> didn't, didn't get me. Oh, okay. So you don't go in here yet. There from the floor. Yeah. So, yeah, don't go in there yet, because you can't do anything. Do enough, I am. So, yeah, go ahead and go back to the main hall. Just go ahead and run straight through the middle. Yeah, and, okay. And if you wait run, until they're right about to... If you run straight through the middle, and then go out of sight, they won't, they won't notice. Use your castle key, and we can go through here. Awesome. Alright, now in the next area. Just skip that little guy. Because, frankly, these guys are just annoying. Go ahead and go up the stairs. They're quite easy to uh, evade. But hey, if you really love star points, it is a good it is a good idea to fight all the enemies, but sometimes it just gets really annoying. This yeah. definitely isn't a game where you really have to grind, so you don't yeah. have to worry about fighting every enemy you see, but Yeah, this isn't really a really grinding game. game. Though it does make it easier to fight every enemy. Alright, go across the bridge. Go through here. We're up to we're up to ten minutes. Do it. Uh, I want to. Fine, okay. He's like whispering to he's whispering to me, bomb that him, bomb that him. Fine, fine. Okay, bomb at him. First of all, watch. Boom. It opens the door. <laughs> I, dude, I for totally forgot that was there. Oh yeah. my gosh. I totally forgot that was there. Okay. So go ahead and knock that guy out. I'm gonna use a body slam on him. Boom. And. No. Uh, Power jump him so it'll kill him. 
boat. And he's down. Alright, now we can go through that hole in the wall. That, frankly, I forgot was there. <laughs> totally forgot. Okay. So, there's three panels we can go into. Do you remember which one it is? I usually just break them all open and then go in, but, uh... Well, what's that gonna do? That one's, uh, to the bouncy thing. That one's to the table you need. And that one's just to the front door. So, we wanna go in here? Yep. So drop down here, and we'll be over to this bed. So now we can use Para Carry to... go... and grab this badge. Now, D down there's pound. a D-down D down jump, jump and a D-down pound badge. Yep, two different. I, it's, what they're supposed to do is they hit your enemy and they lower the defense. I have tried the, these out and they just don't seem very effective to me. You can try them out and see how they work for you. but I actually agree completely. I never useless. really used them because, yeah, it does lower the defense by one, but really it's one enemy. Come on. Like, it can be helpful in bosses. Those yeah, I can see that. Doesn't work in bosses though. I don't even know, to be honest. Yeah, I've only tried I really it don't. Times. Just don't use that badge. I don't know. You can, you can if you'd like. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. Holy crap, that was creepy. Oh my gosh! Don't hurt me! 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 What the? Oh, <laughs> that guy's got a really you good just line can't of sight. Break, can you? That guy's got a good line of sight, man. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Go through the you're door. You're good, you're good. You're good, you're good. Okay, so these, these are spikes. <laughs> <laughs> these are spikes. You don't want to get hit by those. So go ahead and go with Lady Bao before they open. That was close. <laughs> I'm good. I'm very cautious with those. Castle Key. So Ooh. actually, you do need to go through here. Uh, scary. It doesn't like kill you or anything, it just uh, hurts you by one. And sends you back. And sends you back to where you left from. Okay, we're good. Yeah. Awesome. We'd never have to do that again. Yay. <laughs> go through the door. Okay. That's close. And you can go either way here, actually. Yeah. And you can fall down there to get that star piece from earlier. Yeah, I that, I'll do that later. Yeah. So go to this clock. You can move it to open this doorway. Go through here. What's in here? Okay. This is actually... Uh, this is kind of cool. So open this uh, drawer. To use para, para curry. Para curry. Para curry. Okay. And go up these bookshelves. Go into this secret room. And we get a new badge. This is the Mega Rush badge. It makes it so when Mario is in peril, uh, which means he only has one health left, his attack power will go up by four. So that's pretty insane. It makes it, like, since my power jump does six damage, it'll make it do ten damage when I'm in peril. And then there's also the Power Rush badge that you got with Peach that you'll be able to give to Mario yeah, at some get, point. You can get that soon. And if you have that and Mega Rush on, you will do yeah. six more damage yeah, when you have one health. It's ridiculous. So, actually, guys, we're about to the mark here. So, I'm going to go ahead and stop right here before we uh, fight this guy and open this door. So, in the next part, we will continue on in Tubble Blubba's Mansion. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.